Hey guys, and welcome to Cross Out with me, Tanzan. How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I hope you're doing pretty good. If you guys like today's episode, please like and share as you see fit. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. So this is a brand new game to the channel. Uh, and so far, I really like this. Uh, <laughs> it is a post-apocalyptic world where you do battle in weapons of mass destruction that we build, pretty much. Um, well, everything, if you've played Robocraft, everything in this game is pretty, uh, will feel pretty uh, similar. Or familiar so uh as you can see we have our vehicle here i've i'm up to level three i've played a couple of games got some uh an extra gun some extra armor on the truck and stuff like that and we'll go into that in just a second i just wanted to show you everything in here so there is build battle test drive and up here is gas and here is your currency so how much money you have so gas is used for a certain type of raid i mean uh, sorry <laughs> not raid a certain uh gameplay so we'll go into, um, I guess we'll go, yeah, we'll, we'll leave the garage for last. So we'll start from this side and go over and we'll cover these two in just a second. Um, you can see uh, my username and then obviously how much experience I have and the faction I'm part of. And you might be wondering what do you mean by factions? Well, there are four different factions, I believe. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, sorry, five different factions. And in each faction, you learn new parts um so down here i don't know if we can yeah there we go so this faction will teach us all of these at certain levels so you get paints uh armors weapons you know uh what's this veteran container you get crates yeah loot crates uh, you know there's just so many things it looks like you get a per like a, a profile picture or portraits um spikes stuff like that so there's a lot of stuff in this game um we're only level three, so I don't have a clue what everything is going to take uh, <laughs> or is going to give us, right? As you guys can see, there are different uh, colored, or I guess different tier of weapons. So there, I think it's common, uncommon, legendary, and epic also. So I believe these are uh, uncommon. Uh, no, these are rare, sorry. And let's see, rare. Doesn't really help us there. Okay, so these ones are relic. Well, that look at that thing, eh? Porcupine mine layer. Are you serious? <laughs> but yeah, they have uh, they have quite a few. You know, most of the guns seem to be like um, based off of real life. What's happening? You know, what kind of weapons you can actually mass produce right now? I guess. <laughs> but yeah, there's uh, the engineers, the lunatics, nomads. Oh, sorry, yeah. Uh... Yeah, so you must have common, rare, epic, legendary. We'll just say it that way. Uh, we'll figure those out sooner or later. Uh, nomads, scavengers, and then uh, steppenwolves. Or, yeah, steppenwolves. But as you can see, they, each one of them has different types of mechs or vehicles, sorry, that they give you at certain levels. And then, as you can see, there's like a bug bot down here. has legs on it. So it... It's got, it's pretty cool so far. <laughs> it is an open beta. Uh, we'll go to the market. This is where you can sell parts and your scrap. So scrap metal is pretty much currency. It's uh, you can use it to build stuff, or you can sell it and then use the what you've sold to actually purchase stuff. So you know, uh, my offers, history. I've never, I've sold just a little bit of scrap, nothing too fancy. Uh, you have storage. So this is what we have in our storage at the moment. Nothing too fantastic. We need to open this loot crater. So this crate I got today for logging in. So yeah, I think you get the container or the crate for every day you log in, or I guess not the crate, you get a different reward every day you log in, um, but you don't get a loot crate after every battle, just so you guys know. So I'll we'll open it. Uh, I wanna know what's inside. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, so we only get one item, huh? Alright, make it good, make it good. Radio, okay. Radio, uh, what is it? Increases the radius of information transmission to allies to 450 meters. Uh, nothing too fantastic there. That's alright, though. Can't win them all. Then shop, you can uh, buy certain things. Now, there is a pay-to-win aspect. Well, I don't know if it's pay-to-win, but yeah, you can use actual money to buy certain things, right? So... <laughs> there is that expedition or exhibition sorry um 
yeah, you can put your bots up here or techs or vehicles up here and sell them, which is kind of cool. I'm sure there's probably some really neat ones in the game. Like, look at that. And then, of course, and then there's seasons. <laughs> but right now, we'll get into the garage. Uh, go to build. Now, everything's a little bit fast. Now, if you look at the top of the screen there, there's a bunch of uh, buttons, or it shows you everything you can do. So I'll just uh, get rid of some stuff on the vehicle so we can uh, kind of do it together. I'll just remove those two parts. So I have an extra gun on the front here which is the LM54 cord. Um, you can see the damage, fire rate, range, accuracy, and time overheating. Um, everything else too. The energy points is seven out of seven. So that's for this vehicle. Uh, sorry, at the very bottom there, it says seven out of seven, and uh, mass is 2000, or 29, 29 out of 6,000 kilograms. So that's the vehicle overall. So we can only have seven weapons on here, or seven energy points, which is usually the you know weapons plus something else, right? Um, Oh, what? Okay, so anyways, <laughs> so we got a, we got three machine guns on here. Uh, the two on the top are the SM Hornets machine guns. Um, they're not too bad. And then I put some extra plating on the side here. Sorry, right there. Here. And on the tailgate. <laughs> and then obviously we had some on the front. So to uh, put a part, we got to find a part. Did I not take it off? There it is. Uh, we wanted this one, the radiator grill. So... Gotta find the attach points, and I can't remember here. Okay, hold on. Gotta see. Uh, e. Oh, you know what? Control Z. No. Hmm. That's interesting. I did have it working before, all right? <laughs> all right, for some reason I can't get the <laughs> the radiator grill to actually uh, rotate for us like we had it before. So we're just gonna put this uh, bumper grill on here. And as you can see, our weight just went up to 3,003. Uh, it's just extra armor because there is ram damage in this game. So you can actually ram somebody to death. Uh, I'm also gonna put a gas tank in the back here and we'll see if we can't get that to rotate properly. There we go. <laughs> so, uh, what is it? During fights, you can collect gas, um, which we'll need for certain types of uh, games. And uh, if you die with your gas tank, like how we have it or whatever, um, it does a certain amount of damage uh, in a certain amount of, you know, a certain radius. Like it says, uh, allows you to receive fuel in PvP battles, does not stack with multiple barrels, upon destruction explodes and deals 900 damage in 10 meter radius. So that's, you know, why not, right? If you're going to die, you might as well just go out in a big bang, right? <laughs> um, I wish I could, maybe, maybe we should try and get just a little bit lower. Uh, and then we will go and look at the different styles of game. Now you're seeing that other, um, this thing right here. This is the car jack. You need this in order to flip yourself. And uh, otherwise, if you don't have this, you have to uh, rely on somebody coming by to actually unflip you if you flip your vehicle so <laughs> it's a little bit more difficult uh just in case you do i guess get flipped so we'll say we're done here okay so then we'll go to in test drive you can just go there's like uh some dummies out there that you just uh, drive out and shoot or whatever but we're gonna go right into a battle so we here's the battles so these are mission battles there's quite a bit of them and then there's raids, brawls, and so far. So there's a free for all. Um, I think this yeah requires level ten, storm warning, ten, and race. There is a race in here. Hey, well, what do you know? Um, and then yes, and then there's you know other ones. Uh, PVE, a team of players fights raiders, which is actually really cool. We'll check that out. And then there's cargo race, uh, three to four people. But at the moment, we're just gonna do. Um, the PvP players against each other. But we'll get, uh, we'll do this one to get a shotgun because we, I don't have any of these. Uh, maybe this one right here, the Lupra shotgun. Nope, we don't have any of those, those parts. We have all of this. Uh, so we're just gonna go down here and get into a game. Now, getting into the games or matches is usually pretty fast. Um, yeah, there we go. <laughs> 
So, uh, what is this? Capture the enemy base, which is over there. Um, and you only get one life. That is the one thing about this. You don't get uh, multiple lives. Alright. Here's the rest of our team. Yeah, you know what? We'll stick with the group. Normally I go off by myself, but... Ooh. Okay. We're taking fire. <laughs> What's with the tractor? <laughs> Got him. Got him. And even if we if we destroy their whole team, uh, we'll get we'll win the game. I don't know where the rest of them are. They probably have a couple sitting at the base. All right. Uh, and there is MVPs for the, like, the, for most kills and stuff like that. So me and another guy are tied up in the top left there. We'll see what happens here. So on the enemy team, there are four of them left. I don't know where they are, but... Oh, they're capturing our base, or trying to. Alright, well, he's a little excited there. <laughs> so this is a fairly easy round. It kind of gives you an idea of what's going on. So, winner, uh, win 10 battles against live players. Uh, we received 1,273 experience. Uh, daily missions, yes, you get daily missions. Uh, we are kind of close to one. And this show mission stats. Uh, so the person that... Uh, yeah, he got uh, MVP just because of his score. So, that's alright. Uh, and there we go, we're into another game. You don't even have to <laughs> capture the enemy base again. Uh, from a radio. Okay. Well, we'll see what happens here. Getting in and in the games is super fast. Like, as you guys can see, right? Seems like the queue times are about 5 to 10 seconds. Yep. And like I said, this is uh, this is an open beta. Um, you can't get it on Steam uh, at the moment, um, but if you click on the website link in Steam, it will take you to their website where you can download it. And yes, you can make our your vehicles a lot bigger than what we have. Uh, more axles. And there we go. There's some ramming damage. There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> We're getting a lot of assists. We're not getting uh, individual kills here, unfortunately. Yeah, we only have one kill. We have... Uh, I think we probably have two or three assists, though. And that's capturing the base will uh, instantly uh, speed us up. Or give us a higher score, sorry. I think there was a guy there. And as you guys can see, everybody else is showing up with their, their pickup trucks. Did we get that one? No, we didn't get that one. <laughs> so how many vic- I mean, uh, not victors, how many assists did we get on that one? Uh, we did get stickers down here. First blood, uh, became the first to kill an enemy in the battle. Uh, helped three. And helped four, so I think we got four assists there. Yeah, four assists. Which still didn't even go to- Ah! <laughs> Alright, we'll try another game. Uh, we got 1,333. Uh, experience there. Oh, it kicked us out. That's odd. Um, okay, let's... Uh, oh, and we're back in. <laughs> Your car will be written. I'm not 100% sure what's going on here. Okay. Capture the enemy base again. Sometimes it has a different type of mission, like... Um, like eliminate the other team or something. Uh, I think we're going kind of down low here. 
Yeah, this is the river one. So there's a bridge right above us here, where you're probably going to see most of them. Can't zoom in, unfortunately, with our the, the guns we have. Um, I don't know if that's a. Whoa, there's that. What? That's the first time it's like a drone or something. There we go. <laughs> oh, we're on fire, you guys. Oh, and there we go. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So, as you can see, they have uh, some, like, swords on the front of them there. But this is to uh, increase the ramming damage. That's actually really cool, this little drone thing that's hovering over top of him. And there he goes. <laughs> yeah, look at how long his uh, bot is there. Ooh. Let's see him fire that thing again, huh? Hey? <laughs> Alright, where is it? Come on! Find an enemy. Or are they all dead? No, nope, there's uh, three of them still alive. One has four kills. Actually, one is the only one that's actually... Actually killing people. <laughs> Come on. So, uh, he also has different wheels here. He has, yeah, he has uh, better wheels than what we do. Oh, we missed. Wow. Oh, that guy must be AFK. Oh no, he's firing. Firing? Did we just lose? No, we have one guy alive. Who's stuck. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Alright, yeah, and as you guys can see, we'll go one more uh, round, and that should put us to uh, level... Level 4? Uh, time is out, you have fewer vehicles. Huh. I don't understand why I have fewer vehicles, but... That's alright. All right, what's this one? Capture that, okay. This is actually a new level to me. So we're here. Hmm, press two to reset camera to its default option. Problem with this one is that you gotta trust the people that are behind you. Oops, didn't mean to do Get out of here. <laughs> See what I mean? He's gotta blindly go after them. Are we on fire already? We might lose this one really quickly, you guys. Yeah. Come on. Blow up and give us the... <laughs> wow. So on the side there, it says Survivor Parts, and you can see that one person right here. Oh! That's what he's using. Did he have to, like, anchor himself to the ground, I wonder, to actually use that? Kinda looks like it, eh? Or maybe his tech just kinda fell apart? Ooh. <laughs> All 
right, not even close to getting a full level there. But we'll go back to the garage here. And yeah, that's uh pretty much it. Get the gosh, get the shotgun, all that good stuff. Uh, friends list, you know what I mean. <laughs> but yeah, that's uh that's gonna do it for the first episode of Crossout, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you guys like the episode, please leave a like, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.